Hi, this is Proco Taco here. I'm driving, so this is probably dangerous. Don't do this, kids. But it's hockey car day, and um, I just went to Vaughn Mills, just north of Toronto, uh, to get some uncut sheets because they're giving them away at the uh, Hockey Pro Life Toys R Us. Uh, so I went to get those first. I'm gonna head over to AJ Sports World now um, and grab some actual packs uh, so we can rip open. Uh, might stop by 401 Games as well since they're nearby the Vaughn location that is. And then maybe we'll head into the downtown core later. Um, but yeah, I'll check in a bit. See you guys soon. So, the gentleman had some inaugural images packs he sent me as well. Inside 401 games, that is. I got the Suban card, which is the 16th card in this year's set. And then we also got a pack. Um, and we bought some stuff that we might open up on the show. So, let's, uh, that was our 401 games. Let's go check out AJ Sports World. It's just south of here, I believe, the 401 games in Vaughn location. Um, uh, right there, and then, uh, yeah. Yes! Let's go get some free packs. Ooh, it's my shadow. I like the groundhog, I haven't seen that shit in a while. <laughs> Anyways, we're here at AJ Sports World, we're gonna go inside now. Whee! Wow, they had a lot of cool stuff in AJ Sports World that I had never... I've never uh, been inside AJ Sports World before. You can see it's behind me, somewhere there. Oh, it's one of those buildings. Anyways, uh, lots of freaking cool stuff. Um, I didn't know it was actually like a, like a hobby shop too. They actually have a lot of wax in there. I think it was on sale today, but I didn't grab anything. There. Gotta check out a few other spots first, so. So we just got our free pack of Packy K to um, AJ Sports World and we're driving to our next location. Now we're going to go to Red Nails 2. Um, there's two locations. Uh, we're going to go to the one at the mall. I forget what the mall is called. Anyways, it's at uh, Jane and Wilson for you know, Toronto peeps who are wondering. Uh, there's a hobby shop there, Red Nails too. We're gonna check it out, see if they got any sales on some hacky cards. Sup! So we're here and we went in already. I'm just trying to flip the camera. I thought I had an option to to uh, go from selfie mode, but I guess not. Uh, so we went into Red Nails too at the uh, Sheridan Mall in North York is what it is. Um, so the, this pack you get for free, five cards in here, um, and there's a 16, um, the set is 16 cards, um, and this is the 16th card, uh, but you don't get this card in the packs, um, you actually, oh crap, dropping it everywhere, damaging the merchandise, darn it, uh, so as you can see they're Canada 16, you get this by making a um, purchase of $10 or more. Uh, which isn't too bad, 10 bucks. Uh, I just bought two packs of uh, Series 1, uh, 15, 16, McDavid here. Uh, so yeah, hopefully we have some luck with these. And uh, we're going to grab something to eat now because I'm hungry. Probably going to go grab some shawarma. And then we're going to make a few more stops, see if we can get some more packs. And yeah, stay tuned. Holy crap, Toronto traffic. It's like 1.30 in the afternoon and you can't move anywhere. I'm going to start walking from location to location. This is absolutely ridiculous. Oh my gosh, I don't know what the hold up is. Come on people, let's go. I need hockey cards. I can't feel my face when I'm with you, or in this case my hands, because it's cold outside still even though it's March. Yay, Canada! Okay, so update uh, on hockey card day. It's like 4 o'clock now. I stopped to eat and we went to, to Red Nails just now, but like... 
Man, there's traffic everywhere. I wanted to go to 401 Games in the downtown one, um, but I don't know if that's going to happen. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to head over in that direction, make a stop at Toys R Us, and get uh, an uncut sheet if they still have any. Hopefully they do um, at the Dufferin Maltings. And um, then maybe we'll go there. I don't know, guys. We'll see. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I lied. I went to another, uh, it's like a comic store. They were participating. I looked on that list, that upper deck posted of the participating retailers, and they were one of them. It's like a comic shop on Blur Street, Blur in Royal York, uh, Excalibur Comics. Really cool. Really cool little spot. Okay, off to Toys R Us. So this is what the sheets look like. I still had some, just got one. Yeah. What's going on you guys? So we're back here at the studio and uh, we went to a few, a few shops. We got quite some stuff. We'll recap everything right now for you guys. Um, I thought I had recorded some more at the end, but I didn't. Good job, Proco Taco, your banana. But anyways, let's have a look at what we got today on Hockey Card Day. So, um, there's these uncut sheets here with the uh, eight cards on there. Um, and these were being given away at uh, Toys R Us, Hockey Pro Life, and uh, I think a few other places. Ended up getting four of them, all at different places, right? Um, and so then these were your packs that were giving the upper deck gave out in Canada. We ended up getting, I believe, eight, six, seven, eight, eight in total, which is awesome. Uh, and so this set is 16 cards, like I mentioned before, but uh, you got to make a purchase and get some uh, some Subans. We got Four Subans. I don't know where the fourth one went. I thought I had it in here somewhere, uh, but it's not there right now. And then we actually bought some stuff too that we can open up right now. Oh, actually, this was a bonus from 401 Games. Um, and so we'll open up these packs here right now on the Proco Taco Show for Hockey Card Day. So let's go. Let's transition now. The Proco Taco Show. What's going on you guys? Proco Taco here to Proco Taco Show and on this show we open up trading cards. Today is a special episode because it's hockey card day and as you just saw we've acquired all these packs, all these Subans which by the way I found, uh, I found the fourth one. He was, uh, he was in the same sleeve there so there's your your four Subans. Um, so let's go ahead and get started with this break here. Um, I only find it fitting to start off with a uh, hockey card day pack. So we got eight of them. Let's open them up. Just like Young Guns reprints in these, apparently. So I'm super hyped for that. I hope we pull one. Five cards per pack. Pure Luke. Dubois, Mark Messier, Austin Matthews, Nolan Patrick, De La Fure, and the checklist. Pack number two. Josh Jose, Daryl Sittler, Eric Carlson, Owen Tippett, Steve Iserman, checklist. I noticed on my sheets I didn't get an Iserman. Kind of upset, but that's okay. Guy Lafleur, Carey Price, Tyson Jost, Mario Lemieux, Connor McDavid, checklist. Wow, I don't think I got McDavid or Lemieux on my sheets either. <laughs> I 
McDavid, Owen Tippett, Mark Messier, Carey Price, and Josh Hosing. These packs are actually really fun to open. Oh my gosh. Steve Eiserman, Connor McDavid, Josh Hosen, Gila Fear, and the Victory Rookies. Okay, this is cool. Victory Rookies of Josh Hosen. That's really cool. I think these are just what exclusive to the hockey card they set. That's really cool. So I guess there's a this is an insert. Would that be an insert? Cue the pool table break. Okay, Tyson, Jost, Mary Lemieux, Austin Matthews, Nolan Patrick, Guy Lafleur, checklist. And so the checklist uh, doesn't have uh, Subban on there, as I mentioned before, he is number 16 in the set. That checklist only going up to 15. I'm guessing we have them all by now. We've opened up six of eight packs. This will be number seven. Owen Tippett, Steve Eiserman, Connor McDavid, Josh Hosang, Guy Lafier, another checklist. Lots of doubles, that's for sure. <laughs> and our last pack here, pack number eight. Uh, Steve Eiserman, Mark Shifley, Owen Tippett. Daryl Sittler, Connor McDavid, and the checklist. It's five cards per pack. I believe we got 40 cards. I'm hoping we build the entire set at least once because I really like building these promotional sets. We got one um, insert here Josh Hosang, Victory Rookie, which is pretty cool. Um, those young guns that I saw are really cool too. I think there was McKinnon, Subban, McDavid, Tavares, and one more. I can't remember who it was. They're like pretty cool reprints, but we have a few more packs here that I bought, so I figured why not just open them up. Uh, this one was actually given to me too, 401 Games in Vaughn. Uh, inaugural images of the Golden Knights little promo set. I thought this might be like a full set, but it looks like this is the 13th card here, so I'm just gonna open it up and uh, see what these cards look like. I'm guessing it's a little mini set to collect as well, not just like a mini or set in a pack. So Derek England, inaugural images. Luca Sibsa and Malcolm Subban. Three cards in there. Uh, four, six, and 13 in the set. Really cool. I'd actually like to build this. Nice inaugural. Like I said, I love the promotional sets. They're just so difficult to get your hands on. Um, but yeah. Uh, probably gonna be looking for one of those sheets with Iserman on it, to be honest to you. Uh, let's open up our Centennial set pack. I uh, bought this one at Red Nails um, to get the one of the PK Subban cards that I got. Hobby pack. Let's just move the base to the front. Bob Rose, Ken Baumgartner, Alan Bester, Tyler Bozak. Retired numbers of still apps, and we have a decoy, my favorite. So retired numbers was our insert in that pack, and now we got two um, series one packs. I don't think these were hobby. I think they were retail. I'm not a hundred percent sure. I can't remember, but also got them at Red Nails. Different Red Nails location though. This one was at the Sheridan Mall, I think it was called. Pearson, Jurgensen, Pouliot, Grand Fear, Shining Stars, regular. Pacioretty, Gaudreau, Pouliot, and Taze. And 
So we got David Perron, Spurgeon, Reinhardt, and Jake Allen, UD Canvas. We got Ekblad, Kalorn, Lindholm, and Falk to end off our hockey card day break here. So that concludes our break. But before I let you guys go, I did want to ask your opinion on something. So let's switch back to selfie mode here real quick. So what's going on, you guys? I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Um, before I let you guys go, I wanted to ask you, um, what do you think about doing like a vlog style uh, episodes like we did today? Um, I was thinking... Uh, we could do like a maybe a different series like the adventures of Proco Taco and still have the Proco Taco show with breaks um, But I wanted to uh, hear from you guys before I decided on anything of How you feel about that? Um, do you just want to see breaks on this channel or would you like to see kind of vlogs like you did today? as well sort of uh, Proco Taco adventuring off into the world maybe finding um, packs of hockey cards and stuff um, so yeah let me know in the uh, comment section below feel free to leave a comment um, always encourage you guys to leave comments I may not always reply to them but I do see them so thank you for leaving those comments guys and um, that being said I want to thank you guys for watching we're right here on the outro screen I guess so um if you enjoyed that make sure to click that like button for me as that really helps me out and if you're new here this is what we do this is the proco taco show we open up trading cards on a weekly basis and share that experience with you and i hope you guys enjoy that if you want to join our community here on youtube all you got to do is click that subscribe button and you'll become a member of proco taco nation all right my friends so thank you so much for tuning in thank you for spending hockey card day with me um and until next time peace out crackle yakko thanks so much for watching guys hope you enjoyed it if you'd like to watch another episode you can click the square there or there and um make sure you subscribe to the channel over here and you can always check me out on social media at Taco. until next time my friends Peace out.